May I help you? Ah! Oh, I, um, well, you see. Huh? Mumbling is an unfortunate habit. Speaking clearly can help convey your point more effectively. In fact, this could be a key to improving your interpersonal relationships. Wouldn't you agree, Boogie? W wait! You know who I am? Of course I know everything about everyone at this school. Senior, Homeroom 1, Boogie. Enrolled in the Classic Guitar Club. Motto, no fear. Has not made many friends in the last three years. Once fainted at the sight of a wasp in the hallway. Frequently harassed by middle school students. Oh, oh my gosh, that's so embarrassing. Anyway, what are you doing here? Do you have any business to discuss? Oh, um, see, I... Huh? Y you know, about the festival. Is it too late to sign up for the contest? It is, right? Huh. Never mind. Sorry for bothering you. Bye. Hmm. Are you looking to perform in the festival? Oh, oh well, my friend wanted me to ask for her. What friend? Uh... It's not too late to sign up. We'll give you the necessary forms and you can... Hand them off to your friend. Thank you. My music sheets. Hope no one saw them. Ugh! I'm so stupid! So, so, so stupid! Huh? Is someone in here? Everywhere I look, there's weak music, sellouts, and poses. We need to teach them what real music is. Now, shall we begin? We have an emergency plot device. Another strange one. There's a disease going around the school. A disease? Shouldn't I stay away then? Don't worry. It's more like that squid... thing that happened. I'll fill you in when you get here. Hey, plot device, what's up? 
Did you see those weird people? That's not normal for here, is it? Yeah, I saw them. And no, that's not normal. There's more of them at the school, too. They're all headbanging and screaming, ROCK! And they're all like, "Woo!" Wish I could be that excited about anything. Nothing bad has happened yet, but it feels inevitable, doesn't it? <laughs> Have I been a dog for too long? I'm getting used to these sharp senses. I have been feeling these... urges. Digging in the ground, gnawing bones, you know. They got stronger after I became a dog. You know what, never mind. How have you been? Anyway, about those weird kids. I think the new transfer student has something to do with it. Yeah? He has grey skin and red eyes. Oh, and an eye patch. Yeah, everything about him screams troublemaker. So if you see him, keep an eye on him. Make sure he's not causing, you know, trouble. Look out for moats and stuff. Standard transfer student procedure. As for me, I'll guard that field. <laughs> I'll investigate that pretty girl over there. See ya. Head to the office. All right, now that we have everyone here, we can begin. There's a powerful disease spreading around the campus. Disease? They look pretty normal to me. You would say that, Oz. No, it's another unusual infection. Those infected become hopelessly infatuated with rock and roll. The infected start on the first day of our new transfer student, Damien. I do wish transfer students would stop causing such headaches. Well, present company excluded. Aw, oh, thanks! Why rock? That's so 90s. That Damien kid sounds lame. Lame or not, we must take this threat seriously. When Cygnus arrives, I will seek approval from Mr. Stan to view his records. Ah, there she is. Can't stop the rock. Must rock out! Uh. Well, so much for my plan. Anyone else have a particularly brilliant idea? You guys aren't taking this very seriously. Hey, bro! As long as I'm not a squid, we're cool! It's just some dope in his little garage band! We can take him! Take him? Like a battle? You got it, Niner! We'll make our own band! And we rock his stupid face off! Eye patch and all! Hawkeye, do you play any instruments? Does it matter? I got that look that drives the groupies wild! That Joe no se ca! Did you just try to speak French? I sure lay dead! Lay baby! Do you really like it? Maybe you should try learning French from a book, not the internet. Anyway, we're a bunch of talented dudes and chicks. We can rock out! Yes, about the instrument. We could call ourselves Rock Eye! See what I did there? Hawkeye, do you have any musical talents? We'll put Aaron on guitar. Chicks with guitars are hot. Find your own chick, you mutant. I want no part of this. Whoa, Erina! You don't care about saving the school? It's just some stupid rocker. Handle it yourself. Can't stop the rock! Must rock out! Fine! 
Don't come crying to me when we're all superstars and you're still stuck here. Now, who wants to rock? Uh... Didn't Eckhart used to play the bass? Wait. Alright! Eckhart's on bass. Agreed! Next up is drums! Oh, me, me, me! Pick me! I've always wanted to play the drums! Can we please take this seriously? Well, that limits our options. Plot device. You're the only one I can count on now. Could you go up to the third year classroom and find Damien? I need you to find out who he is and what his goals are. Don't get me wrong, I'm not intimidated by this roguish spirit. Uh... What? What is this? Can't stop the rock. Must rock out. Everyone is falling apart. Do you know where Damien is? Rock and roll forever. How dare you speak the name of the great Damien? Uh... Woo! The great Damien is practicing at the old school building. The Dark Lord of Rock has come! Our wicked prayers are answered! Oh, great Damien! I should head to the old school building. You're here. Did you feel it? The moat. They've taken over the classrooms. I'm choking on dark energy. Now, hold up a second. These moats are completely different from the ones you fought so far. Listen, I think the moats in the old school building are spawned from the infected students. If they're connected, they might hurt your friends if you fight the moats. But don't worry your big weird head. I, as always, have a plan. Ta-da! This musical weapon should vaporize those rockin' moats. And it can be yours for five easy payments of... Ha, <laughs> just kidding, you can have it. Seriously though, could I have some money? No, but thanks for the guitars, I guess. Hey, hey, hey! Hey! This is no ordinary guitar. It's got six strings of powerful magic. Grendel made this guitar. So, um, be careful with it. He might not know I took this and gave it to you. It's not important. Let's head in. Wait, you do know how to play a guitar, right? You better, because I sure don't. Just beat on it, right? Hit it with a stick? I like sticks. Guitars are string instruments. Strings, sticks, it's all fetched to me. That thing's enchanted, so it's probably indestructible. Swing it as hard as you can. Ah, I see some over there. Now go! Beat the living rock out of them! 
Go, go, go! I thought I heard someone else playing. Hey, plot device! Where were you? You always disappear on us. Whoa! Is that a guitar? Nice! I knew you wouldn't last down. You've come a long way. Oh? oh? Who's there? Nice guitar you've got there. Sure would be a shame if someone... Rocked you! Let's throw down. Pretty good, but not good enough. Holy cow, plot device! He... he has skills! Pathetic. Thinking you could be the great Damien with a guitar. Hey, you guys started it. Spoken like a true loser. <laughs> you guys are so not nice. Why are you doing this to our school? Oh, it's nothing personal. After we take this school, we'll go on to bigger and better things. We're just a stepping stone to stardom. At least that kid wasn't boring like all the others. The Guitar Club girl was a total joke. Oh, I almost forgot about her. What a chump, with her stupid little song. No one will have to suffer her awful performance now. If anything, we're heroes. We still have to suffer through your idiocy. Oh jeez, Eckhart looks serious. Weak words from a loser like you. Yeah, why don't you losers go make a loser club with that loser from the other loser club, huh? <laughs> why don't you shut your stupid face? Wh what? Man, even your outfits are stupid. Are you rockers or party clowns? H hey, that's... Ha! <laughs> I can't believe we ever took you seriously. Bigger and better things? Your weak songs wouldn't get you a nickel on the street corner. Oh! Weak... songs? You think you can back up those big words? No, I know I can. Um, wait, Erina, we... It's on. The last performance. That's right. The last performance? For you. I... Irina? A simple showdown isn't enough now. We need to make a bet. You never stop talking, do you? Fine. Losers have to moon the whole school. Deal? What? <laughs> Fine. That's a fitting punishment for insulting my music. Irina, what were you thinking? We're total noobs at this, dude! We can't win!
Huh, right. Um, guess we better start practicing. Uh. Hello? Hey, plot device. I'm super worried about this whole band thing. I don't want the school to see my butt. It's not for the general public. Irina has such a short temper. I've never seen her as mad as she was last night, though. I wonder why. Anyway, we're gonna practice on the roof. Don't be late. You have to come, okay? I should go to the school roof. Fast. What up, plot device? Well, Aaron has hissy fit put our butts on the line. Literally. Man, I'm supposed to be skipping class right now. That was pretty dumb, Irina. Ugh, I know, I know. He just made me so mad. I can't stand people that arrogant. I had to say Good something. Good for you. I don't know why you had to drag all of us into it, though. I mean, not like I care. I'll happily share my booty with the fine females of the school. Yeah, half the school's already seen Hawkeye's lily white butt, so he's got nothing to lose. Me, though, I'm transferring if we don't pull this off. <laughs> Look, we'll jump off the bridge when we get to it. We need to practice. Before that, we need a song. Ideas? That's the easy part, girl! I ran a few already. Me too! I wrote something too! I have something, but we don't have to... Let's just play all of them right now and pick, even though mine is obviously the best. Yeah, let's do it! Here we go! Yeah, baby! The hawk is coming at ya! So hot, so bad! On a hunt for your heart! Handsome and strong, good with a song! And perfect for you! Fail! Vito. Oof, I feel nauseous. You guys suck! Showing my butt would be better than singing that. Oz, you're up. Alright, listen to this! I like you. I mean, I really, really like you. Can you hear my beating heart? You're always on my mind. Not bad. It's cute. Every meal I run to you. Croquets, croissants, sandwiches, and ramen. That's your secret love? Do you pay any attention to Oz? It's no secret. <laughs> I wrote it at the taco place last night. Well, it was cute. A card, you're next. Just FYI, I didn't write it for the public. Black room, beyond the black room, there's a wall, a wall, a wall. I lie down here and wait, wait for that wall to come down. Dude, if you ever need to talk about your issues... Shut up. I was in a dark place when I wrote it. Turn the light on next time, emo boy. Cripes, never mind. Well, now what? 
we still have to practice. So, let's start with something simple. There are practice music sheets in the music room. Plot device, can you get them for us? We'll start setting up the instruments. I'll run down to the fourth floor music room. You know how good we are. Our band will be the last act. The performance order is decided through random drawings. Doesn't matter. I already know we're the only band. Everyone else was too scared, am I right? No, there's one other band. What, the Green Chicks Loser Brigade? Ha! <laughs> All the same to me. Hmm. What can I do for you? I need to know more about Damien. Turns out this is his thing. He's transferred to several schools, and every time he dominates the music scene for a month or so, and then moves on. I suppose we're his latest conquest. Shouldn't we stop him? Why? It's not violence, it's music. Technically, they're not violating any rules. I have to play by the rules. If you'd like to stop him, beat him at his own game. Anyway, what's this about mooning the whole school? Whose moronic idea was that? You've blown this up way bigger than it needed to be. Again, I have to play by the rules. You're on your own. Wow, did you see that? They are nuts! What are you doing here? I'm here for a show! Music? Since Eyepatch McJerkface showed up, no one comes here anymore. This place is all dusty. Which means the moats are running rampant. I'll need to hunt moats until I find 10 music sheets. Hey, that was quick. Guess you need to get to practice, huh? Whoa, what was that? Sounded like a marching band being ran over by a garbage truck. Are we under attack? Sigh. I should head back to the school roof and face the music. <laughs> Thanks, plot device. Now, shall we begin for real? It was intense! I was killing on the guitar! That sure was a thing. I'm so glad I don't have to suffer alone, plot device. Um, are we sure this is the right instrument for me? Once more, from the top. What is all this ruckus? Uh... If you're trying to torment the school, you're doing a fine job. That's enough. <sighs> I thought some good music would help her. I suppose I should look elsewhere. 
again. What are you monsters up to? Is this a protest? I understand it's probably hormones or something, but please, get it out of your system already. Uh, we were just practicing our music. What? Really? Uh, okay. Oops. Rock! He must have thought we were breaking instruments. At this rate, I'm going to be lumped in with the rest of you. Cygnus and I should go. Peace out. Ugh! We can't lose! Again, from the top! Students! Please control yourselves. This horrible noise is making me age by the minute. <sighs> but you're already old, yo! Ah, I'm so tired of this! Can we practice somewhere else? I want to play real drums! Fine. Whatever. Let's go book a practice room. It'll have real drums and no one to bother us. Uh, that's not cheap. What are part-time jobs for? We'll all work and pitch in a little money. This is an awful lot of work to play at the festival. Musicians are always hungry, but the pain makes you strong. We have to be strong! Wow, you're starting to sound like Hawkeye. Do not make this harder than it already is, Eckhart. Why is it always about me? Let's go see Hugh Head. I bet he can help. Off to the uniform shop then. Yes? Hey, um, do you need any help around here? Oh my goodness, yes. There is always too much to do. Can you work a sewing machine? I can't! Nope. No! Tell me we do! I'll try. Good, good. Uh, so can you fix these pants? Huh? You ruined them! How many legs do you think people have? Get out! You call that suing? Ah, my golden boy! Show him how it's done! You can't be serious. Shall I begin the tailoring? What do we do? He's so mad. We broke the machine. It's okay. We'll apologize formally when he cools down a bit. I guess that's it for working. Where to next? Hmm... I've heard you were looking for part-time jobs. How did you? Where did you? 
heart's kind of creepy sometimes, you know? Mr. Head just phoned the school. Apparently, you lot deconstructed a pair of his pants? Uh. I've always said this, but Irene needs to learn her own strength. Why do you think I did it? Nineheart, you total... Please, we're getting off topic. I was calling to inform you of an opportunity. Wait, what? To go to the Sunset Lot if you want a part-time job. Hello? Hello? Nineheart has the stupidest flair for the dramatic, I swear! See? Creepy! It's as good a lead as any. Better to take the bus to the Sunset Lot. Students, what are you doing at a construction site? Hello, I heard you were looking for some help around here. Ah, you're here for work. We need people who can lift at least 50 pounds. You look pretty weak. Uh huh. Ha ha ha. I will break you in half. Yeah! Start off with that sack of cement, tough girl! Hey! Where's the new guy? Show them how it's done! Oh? Oh, please, no. Shall I begin... moving some sacks? Sigh. <sighs> Simple as that. Your turn. Fine. Watch this. Whoa. How could she? Wait, what? Wait, huh? <laughs> Get out of here! Go home, losers. You rude little... Why are you everywhere? There's nothing left. All the positions are filled. No jobs! Absolutely no jobs! Thanks, Obama! Man, I'm beat. What now? When in doubt, eat! That's what I always say! Agreed! What should we get? Let's go to Granny's food stand! Alright, let's do it. My treat. Yeah, baby! Uh... You. Are you stalking me? Excuse me? Keep stirring, boy! Foods are burning! Shall I begin... stirring this? Uh... What is wrong with you? I'm so hungry, Irina! You heard the lady. Serve us. Ha! 
Serve losers like you. Run on home. Granny, the part-time kid is rude. How can I help you, dear customers? Yes. Five orders of spicy rolls and make it snappy. Spicy rolls? Snappy rolls! Here, yeah. choke on them. Your shift is over now. Go get some rest, boy. Hey guys, did you see his hands? They're all bandaged up, like an MMA dude. Uh, no, I think he just practices a lot. Whatever. We'll work just as hard. Yeah, except it's too late. We can't win. He's right. I mean, Hawkeye and I are super new to this music thing. It's true. We don't have a snowball's chance. Hey, maybe you'll let us back out. We can play at the festival next year. Agreed. I'm not really excited about being embarrassed in front of the whole school. There's really no reason to go through all this trouble. Next year? Speak for yourself. Sorry, guys. I've been selfish. I dragged you all into this. I'll take care of the bet. Forget about the band. I think we made a mistake. I forgot. She's graduating this year. Oh man. I never blow it that hard. I really want to make fun of you for saying that. But not now. I've never seen her so sad. What do we do? Let's sleep on it. We'll talk to her tomorrow. Okay. Right on! See you tomorrow! What have you people been doing? I've received a complaint from Elec about the construction site. You sure have a way of screwing up- Nineheart, can we not do this right now? Fine. I saw Irene earlier, and I can tell something is going on. She'll probably drop by the school infirmary soon, if you're looking for her. Yeah? Actually, I'll need to meet you there in a bit. There's something I could use your help with. I'll head to the school infirmary and talk to Nineheart. Ah, there you are. Who's that? That's Boogie, a third year student. She's a quiet one. Never thought I'd say this, but she's too caught up in her schoolwork. Plus, there was that incident. Incident? I'm getting ahead of myself. The nurse isn't here right now. Could you find me some fever medicine? I've looked everywhere, but I can't find it. I wonder if I need my eyes checked. Did you find all the medicine? Where were they? I looked everywhere. Oh. What happened? Don't worry about it. Plot device, here, help me bring her fever down. Plot device? I heard about your band. Don't you think you should let plot device know what's going on? 
Uh, fine. Boogie? What are you doing here? Oh, hey. Nothing. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Can you believe it? We're already in our third year. I know, right? All I can think about is how little time we have left now. I never thought school would end. It's kind of sad. In homeroom, I have so much fun that I don't even think about it. But after school, I realize I'll never have this again. Even getting bullied for lunch money or stuffed into lockers. I got so used to it all. I don't know what I'll do without them. After graduation, everyone will go on their own way, even if we get together later on. It will be just to share memories. I won't ever have anything like this again. Uh... Jeez, Buggy. You're not going to die when you leave here. You're looking at this the wrong way. Really? Yeah, don't focus on what you're losing. Make more memories while you can, and take them, and take them with you into the future. But... how do we do that? Let's perform at the festival. With your song. Well, what no 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 I'm far too shy, and I just... No! I can't sing in front of the whole school! I guess that's a bit too difficult. Too bad. I did think it was a bit of a stretch. Boogie was always so crazy shy. Then I found out a couple days later that Boogie signed up for the festival. Who wrote this trash? Oh, I think I'm gonna barf. Th that's my... This is incredible! Was someone actually thinking of playing this crap? I'd rather cut my own ears off. <laughs> for sure, for sure. We can't lose. Damien is serious about music, unlike those stupid kids. Okay, enough talk. Shall we begin the music? So what's this all about revenge for Boogie? Revenge? I wouldn't call it revenge per se. Is this not about crushing Damien to make Boogie happy? Well, no, it's not about Damien at all. Okay, it is a little. But he got me riled up when I made that stupid bet. But what I really want is for everyone to hear Boogie's song. Hmm. Then you'll have to do something about your entry. It's pointless now. Boogie said she threw it away her music. Are you talking about these? Oh! Where did you get that? I happened across them this morning. Tomorrow will be the last day to change your entry. Don't forget. Mm. Oh! Boogie! Are you feeling better? I... Irina? Boogie, I've decided I'm going to perform your song at the festival. I'll get the guitar. What? Uh, no! I can't embarrass you in my place! You wanted everyone to hear your song. I want that too. If you're afraid to do it alone, I'll help. Irina! Can you find the courage? For me? It's our last festival before graduation. 
Don't forget about us, babe. Oh. oh. If we're doing this, let's do it right, yo. With my sexy self and these other guys too, I guess. I can do drum solos whenever Hawkeye screws up. Yeah! Wait. I'll handle bass. Eckhart's pretty good. He's been practicing between classes. Okay. But I have one condition. You can use my song. But Irina has to sing it. What? I wrote the song for you. I mean, for you to sing. I just couldn't tell you, you know? Can you do it, Irina? Sing my song, and I'll be right there in the front row, cheering for you. That's what I want. Can you find the courage for me? It's our last festival before graduation. Wait, that's my line. Okay. Let's do this, guys. Woohoo! Rock Eyes back in session! Nope! Yeah, I couldn't come up with a name that dumb if I tried. Seriously? We'll worry about that later. You guys suck! We have exactly one month until the festival. Practice starts now! Boogie, what do you think? Wow. Is this really my song? Uh, uh. Oh? Oh, oh my, what was I doing? Success! Cygnus! You're seen again! Finally! But... Rock... So <sighs> uh... Once more for Mihail? I'm so worn out today. We can leave him like this for a little longer. I kinda like it better. Word! I was totally thinking the same thing! Hey, hey! Let's do a band photo before the performance! Yeah, boy! Get my good side! I'll take it! Alright, on three! Peace! Whoa, the festival is on! Plot device! Today's the day! You are set? Of course! Coolio! Meet us at the auditorium! And, uh... Yeah? Get me something to set on my stomach, would ya? These butterflies are killing me! Huh? Hey, did you hear? Irina's gonna take on Damien at the festival today! Say what? That 
sounds awesome. But do you think she has a chance? I mean, Damien has an eye patch. I hear the losing band has to moon the whole school. I need to clear some memory on my phone. Ha <laughs> Awesome! Plot device? Plot device? Ah, uh, I hate being nervous. But what if I mess up Boogie's song? Need more practice. Hawkeye, I didn't know you were left-handed. Loosen up, guys. We can't play if you're so tense. Eckhart, you're holding the bass backwards. So, where's Boogie? Will one of you ruffians settle down and give me a hand? I sent some kids to get the festival flyers from the library, and they've been gone for an hour. Mr. Stan the Man! We still need to rehearse! Come down on someone else for once! Not this time, punk. You've got two whole hours until the concert. Plus, I was merciful and let you off the hook when you were playing the Satan music on the roof. Ugh, fine. We'll do your dumb chore. Who's the fastest here? Go! Plot device? Isn't your concert today? What are you doing here? Pamphlets? The moats took them, right? Uh... It's now my fault. Good luck! Wow, look at all that dust. Are you going to perform? I'll be in the audience. Boogie chickened out in the end. Hey, that's what losers do. I almost feel bad for the loser band, doing all that work for nothing. Yeah, almost. <laughs> What is this all about? Huh? Oh, it's you. Like we said, Boogie is gone. She ran off, like the coward she is. Enough. We don't need to waste time on this failure. What, you've got something to say? What did you do to her? I just told her the truth. That today will be a day she'll regret for the rest of her life. What is your problem anyway? My problem is that you idiots think you can goof off and talk big and win, while I've devoted my life to my music. You can't just spout a bunch of clever one-liners and be the hero. You have to work hard, and I've worked too hard to put up with your crap. Boogie ran off? I should return to the waiting room. Hey, no big deal or anything. I'm just wondering, 
is everything all right over there? No, Damien ran Boogie off. Ugh, man. All right, plot device. Come back to the waiting room for now. I'll go through the backyard of the new building to get there. I just told them all about Boogie. Did she really bail on us? But without her, it's pointless. She's probably... Probably at the drizzling strolling path. She always goes there when she's depressed. Plot device, can you get her? We have to finish practicing. To the drizzling, strolling path, then. Can't catch break, can you? I know how that feels. The students from your school, they're having some kind of a rain dance party out here. I'm running out of time, gotta take them down. Plot device, you've got to free the students. I'm ready, send me in. Good luck. Is that Boogie over there? Uh... Hello? Plot device, did you find her? She's right here. Thank goodness. Put her on the phone. Irina. Boogie, are you okay? The show is about to start. I'm really sorry, but I'm just so scared. Boogie, listen to me. No matter what happens, we won't blame you. In fact, I want to thank you for giving us this opportunity. Um... We'll wait as long as we can. You do what you need to do. Um... Plot device? The show's about to start. You should come back. Okay. Irina. That was great! Takes me back to my school days. You know, I was in a cover band for a few years. I played- No one cares. Give your score. <sighs> ten. Whoa! A ten! I will also give a ten. 
your lyrics were quite moving, especially the part about love being pointless. I give it a 7. Your technique was adequate, but not exceptional. And your lyrics were a little overcomplicated. Still, well done. Oh, and if it was a little softer, loud noise affects my skin, so... But yes, well done. You're here. Damien's band's just finished. They're waiting for us. Let's go. Why aren't they starting? Maybe they ran off. No way! Irina wouldn't... To be fair, though, Damien's band killed it up there. Miss Hilla, it's so dark. Hold me. Hey, hey, this isn't the time. Act like an adult. Uh. Erina, what are you doing? Just wait. Just a bit more. Irina, what is it? Erina! Boogie will be here. I know it. I knew it. All right, Irina. This is your show now. <sighs> One, two, three. The old and entire in that and Udi is again. Talk good, got Oh, 
That was great! Better than great! Perfect! Ten! Whoa! Ten. Let me break this down for you. Hawkeye, you are awful. There's no other word for it. Sloppy and showy. Ouch! Drums. I can see you did your best, but your best isn't good enough. You sped up and slowed down at strange times. Oops. Bass was excellent. Vocals and first guitar were excellent. Especially plot device. You were perfect. I don't know how you managed to go unnoticed for so long. Whoa! But most of all, the song was incredible. Clever, moving, and something everyone could relate to. Boogie from the Classic Guitar Club wrote this song. Both the compositions and the lyrics. Irina! Woo! Boogie! Boogie! Therefore, I give you an eight. Woohoo! I... I lost? I... Whoa! Do you feel that? Is that an earthquake? Ah! Uh! Miss Hilla, save me! What the? Get away from me! Plot device, a troublemaker! Lily! We've blinded everyone, so do your thing! You have to hurry! The magic won't last long! I had to remind Elwyn not to use the permanent one, idiot! Damien lost. The devil of rock himself. I can only imagine how frustrated he feels. What just happened? I don't know. I guess the power frizzed for a sec. That's... odd. So... We won. Ugh. I'll give you a break, mainly because I have no desire to see your pasty butt. Just apologize to Boogie, and we can call it even. Hey Boogie, can you come up here? I can't apologize. We deserved to win. Your technique was sloppy, your lyrics were juvenile, and that hog eye guy straight up sucks. Oh yeah? Well, your mother! Leave it to Irina. Despite all of that, your song wasn't half bad. Whoa! Nine heart, nine heart. Yes. Do you have the version of Boogie's song sung by Boogie herself? Yes, I've received a sample track with a registration. Really? I couldn't find it! It's organized by submission date. It should be under February. Huh? Wait, February? Isn't that past the deadline? Uh... Nine heart. I thought we weren't taking late submissions. Uh... Nine heart. I have no recollection. 
Oh, really? Mr. I have to play by the rules? Even I know there are things more important than rules. Like what? Like making memories. <laughs> <laughs>